What's up, peoples? It's a terraformer playing a heterogeneous mixture of Mario that is not th Bros. 3, but sometimes is Bros. 3 in the Bros. 3 engine, and I have to start over here because unfortunately the crab cake guys are existing here. Bounce them around and sometimes make them. Uh, yes, I'm doing a great job. I wasn't paying attention there. <laughs> so I was looking at the counter, which doesn't really go down any if I'm not hitting any crab BKs, like I was calling them at some point yesterday, I believe. That was probably the day that it was. Probably more technically today, but that's besides the point. There's still that one more that I have to get rid of. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, did I not save something? Yeah, it seems like I didn't. BRB. You know, I've replayed a lot of stuff in this hack. I've like, I'd like to think it's, you know, a good thing for this potential speed run that I might do in the future. I don't know if that'll actually happen, because some of these levels aren't levels that I'd like to get all the coins in again. And hey, this... What am I looking at there? That looks pretty weird. That's just where the switch is. Kind of what I thought, because this does look marginally like a recreation level. Although, if that's the case, there's probably, like, things that I should be exploring in every section of the level, so I might have made an ex excuse, or, yeah, see, exactly what I thought. Did that piece switch stop the lava from moving, or am I just mistaken? Is that a mistaken thing, too? I don't know. I like the leaf, but I guess since it's offering me that, it doesn't really matter, I just got rid of it anyway, so any woes about what I had is all gone. Also, I would've, could've used that because, you know, you fly up there and then you get to the exit, but this isn't a normal type of level. It's all skewed up, so I can't really do anything now because I, I lost my required power up. Oh boy, yeah, that's just a little indicator that, hey, if you are big and you enter this level while such, you can have yourself a prize, but if not, you have to go over here and farm for some power up. Yes. I do find it interesting that that's like kind of an outdoorsy section instead of like a um, continually interior of a place. And that doesn't really help me because that is not a leaf. I can't enter here either. Okay. Yeah, because I need a leaf to fly up here and I'm guessing the original level made you do that? Bring one in? Or is there a place in the level? That doesn't seem like Mario official design. So let's check down here in this door and what really? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> um, oh, I guess maybe there was a cape in that one area that I forgot about. No. Oh. Well, <laughs> no, yes, no. It's all right. Ah. That's an interesting life on. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, I like this song. I wonder if there's anything if you fly up there too. Oh, okay, yeah, there it is. So the game kind of tricks you by sending you into this level. I don't know if... I guess I just don't... I remember everything but that room from the original game. So that's interesting, I guess. If I fly up here, I can get a coin, but... Where is- there's the exit pipe, alright, hopefully I don't lose this in the process of getting up there. So let's face it, there's a keen possibility. And there is a lot of peeps with vested interest in me not getting in that pipe. Hopefully I change the location of you! Darn, really? Really? There we go. Okay. And I have all three coins, apparently. I don't even remember where some of them were, or... I mean, one of them was. So that's pretty cool, I guess. Yeah, that was kind of a level from another game, except a little different. And in a, in a way... Well, that looks fancy. I bet I can... Oh, ooh, maybe not. I don't know what this is. This is... This is get stuck on the wall ceiling world. No? What? You didn't jump. 
Uh, oh? Oh? Oh, I could have swore I did something like that. Uh, uh, no! <laughs> well, it wasn't so bad once I figured out what the hell it was I was supposed to be doing, but I could have swore I pressed that button there. And this makes it a lot easier because I can just kind of sneak up here and touch boxes up here that don't have any coins in them anyway. Oh, so it's the same each time, okay. So there's like one here. There we go. That was pretty easy. <laughs> it gets harder when you allow a bunch of spinies to exist. But if you don't, then, you know, that happens. Okay, kind of haven't done a whole lot in this video as far as new content is concerned. What? That was kind of a... I, I, I don't know how to feel. Like, was that harsh to say? I mean, it's true, though. That... <laughs> At the very least, it is true, but I'm not saying that attempting to be a jerkish person, but what's going on here? Can I fly up here to explore things? Would I want to? Is this like a platform that I can... Okay, this happens when I touch that platform. It starts moving. Good job. I thought it was a priority respecting person, but I guess not. Alright, so I allow the plant to be... Uh, this is like kind of throwing some stuff at me here. I wonder if I could get up there with a Goomba Bounce. I'm guessing I couldn't, but I was thinking about it as I was waiting for me to be able to load myself into the level. You're a lot more respectful. I noticed a little bit of, um, not coming out of the, the, the poison. Well, what, what the heck am I doing? It's level <laughs> slightly more. It's like there's a couple parts where it's like you gotta dodge a bunch of things, and then other parts where you just kinda sit there. Hopefully I will play slightly better than the last time I was here. Well, not here in particular, but in places coming up. Good. I managed to get that power up twice. Yeah, I just kind of uh, jumped <laughs> past the plant. And that looks lower, so I worry that... Well, I guess not. I was concerned of there being a coin up there, but that was not the case. Is it gonna be... Oh, there it is. One? So I guess I just won't check those pipes, because it looks too dangerous to check the pipes. Uh, not even. But you had a coin there, so you wouldn't have two coins that close together, would you? I guess you could. Yeah, I think the uh, short stem and green one is the non-respectful one. The red ones, they're good guys. But the green ones, they're kinda jerks. Actually, all plant life in Mario is kind of jerks, except for the fire flower thing. Am I supposed to be following this? Because uh, I wouldn't put it past the game. Okay, I guess not. Because it looks like it kind of falls off the universe at that point. So I'm not going to you know, waste my time watching it do stuff like that. Yeah, my, my mouth is slightly parched. But it would be rude of me to just get up in the mi middle of a video and attempt to make my voice sound more pleasant. <laughs> Maybe after this level. But, uh, is there something up here? Can I get up there? Maybe? Let us try to explore... Maybe with a big jump. Hey, a coin was made! Except it's not a real coin. There it is. Yeah, I don't seem to be able to get enough P speed to reach 88 miles per hour. Except I did there. There we go. Absolutely nothing. Amazing! I spent time on trying to do that jump. I made effort, also. And look what it got me. It got me absolutely nothing. But a coin that I already noticed was existing, so there wasn't going to be a coin up there. But just a one-up, maybe? No, I guess not. 
Also, I realized that um, shell jumps are in fact possible in the SMB3 engine because I was reading about a task of Mario Adventure because no one's actually speedrun it for some reason, I don't know. Kind of find it pretty odd considering that hack is like the, the forefront of good SMB3 hacks. I bet the Captain Southpaw played that hack before. Good job. Alright, because I want to like check these pipes and realize that there's nothing in them but sorrow and regret. <laughs> sorrow and regret, exactly. Ah, ah. Ah, that fireball wanted to get me killed. Is where it is, I don't know. I hope it's in here though. Hearing that boss music, but usually there is a single coin within the confines of boss music. Playing really good. No? Oh, crap. Well, I don't have spin jump here, so... Oh, these don't shoot fire. Okay, I'm a little less concerned then. Because if they were the fire nippers, then... Then it'd be not nipply at all, because it'd be warm. And this coin, man, where is it? There it is. Okay, so I gotta do a thing like this, and then do that. Hooray! That wasn't so bad. What was the ball? Oh, PD the Piranha. I kind of just tanked damage here, didn't I? Ugh. This guy slightly terrifying. Yeah, because he does that. And at least he just kind of gets stun-locked after he hits me. Which is good, because that means I win. <laughs> strategy? Nah. -uh. Well, sort of. It's still strategy. It's not, like, really trying too hard. Well, I try hard in many other aspects of my life, so in video games, kinda not so much. There's a hammer bros here that jumped away or something. I don't know what happened. That looked like it would have been an ice fire. An ice fire, good job there. An ice plant, because of the blue, but I guess that's just with the, uh, the palette of this level. And it'd kind of be excessive because there is the penguin suit, which creates ice fire. <laughs> My new invention. It does not exist anywhere ever. I thought that was going to be another power up. Like, dude, you're too generous. Yeah, being that this is like a last level of a world I'm anticipating, not too difficult because that's how it's been. And usually in hacks, it's like the castle or the last level of a world is like the really coup de gras, hard level thing. This hack, not as much. I mean, in the first world, maybe, but it was just 8-4. I don't know. I still have enough problems with 8-4, though. And that happened. I wonder if I missed anything going down that pipe. Let's see if I can actually go back maybe yeah that's why i did that no so excuse me if i have to not get coin i may or may not have i was gonna say i have a midpoint but the midpoints there's like three of them in castles or something but looks like i don't have to worry about that hooray i didn't realize i was gonna shoot that direction but it did so I benefited out in that regard. Who is the boss of World 6? I said... Is this a, no, it's the same power-up. Who's the boss of World 6? Well, it's this guy again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I don't have a Yoshi for this. Oh no. There we go. Okay, so you just do that. And then he does that. And then... Ah. Okay. Okay. Cool. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Damn. Uh, just gotta avoid the fires from Mega Man 6. And I'll be good. That. <sighs> that. That. Oh yeah, that's sick. <laughs> oh.
behind. Stupid shell physics. There we go. Yeah, this is like really simple if you use the blockades above yourself to survive. <laughs> really simple. And when you're small, you can do this a little better. -er. And you're dead, unless you f fire at me or something. Yeah, real easy boss. I just could not for the life of me figure out a good strategy in the beginning. Well, at least I did. So what's World 7 going to be? What Mario is it going to be based on? I am curious to see. Okay, a massive rocket. So it's going to be Galaxy World? It seems that way. I was going to say rocket. Maybe it's like uh, Super Mario Brothers 2, but... Doki Doki, but... No, it's Galaxy. Interesting. See everybody.